It is Let's Talk Arts and Entertainment on WMAY. Well, there's a brand new streaming performance that you will be able to watch this weekend and is going to be by a local a local performer who um, she is uh, all around different places now, but she uh, is here in Springfield and she will be part of this concert. This will be her concert. So uh, let's talk with Stella Cole. How are you doing, Stella? Hello, I'm great. How are you, Kevin? I'm doing pretty good. I'm doing pretty good. It's been a it's been a while since I've seen you. We uh, we shared the stage a while back in Peter Pan, uh, which was out at the Muni. But uh, you have been doing a lot of different things since then, and uh, and since then, and it's pretty recently you put out a Christmas album, uh, which is a very good album. Tell us a little bit about uh, the process of uh, of how you came to get that album together. Totally. Yeah, well, a lot has changed since Peter Pan, for sure. Um, I now go to Northwestern University outside of Chicago, Illinois. So um, I'm double majoring there in theater and international relations and minoring in German. Uh, So I'm a senior there, about to graduate in March. Um, And yeah, when the pandemic started, they sort of kicked us off campus of Northwestern, um, you know, because of COVID. And I found myself at home living with my parents and my family with not a lot to do. So I started posting videos of myself singing on TikTok and a couple of them blew up. And before I knew it, in a couple of weeks, I had a ton of people commenting, asking me to record an album, put full songs on Spotify, put full songs on YouTube. So my, my most common comment, I think, was that my voice would be perfect for a Christmas album, that it would be perfect on Christmas songs. So I called up a local studio, got a few local musicians together and uh, put some Christmas tracks down. Uh, yeah, it was a lot of fun and I got a really good response from them. It was a really good album and it was great to listen to. And uh, since then you also have a single, uh, Moon River, that you uh, put out. So um, so tell us a little bit about that and how, um, how you uh, came to put that out as well. Yeah, so Moon River has become a really special song, actually, um, both to me and to my followers, the people who have sort of been following along on this uh, this journey I've been on for the past couple of months. I actually do a live stream concert um, on TikTok every Sunday at 7, 7 p.m. Eastern time, and I close every concert uh, with Moon River. So, yeah, it's a really special song to me, and I decided while I was in the studio, might as well um, put down a track of that as well with those same musicians from the Christmas album. And I'm really proud of proud of my work at that one. I just released it about two weeks ago, and it already has um, almost 10,000 streams on Spotify, which is crazy. Um, I've got a, about a thousand, a little over a thousand uh, followers on Spotify now. So if you want to listen, you can type in Moon River with Stella Catherine Cole on anywhere you listen to music. So Amazon Music, Apple Music, iTunes, Spotify. Uh, yeah, so definitely go give that one a listen. Everybody go listen to that. Um, is it also available? Uh, it's also available on YouTube um, as well. It is. Yeah, it's on my cool. YouTube channel. Just look All it up right. on Stella, Stella Catherine Cole. Awesome. Well, I'll be look for, uh, look for that too. You have a concert coming up this weekend, and um, I'm sure we'll be able to hear uh, and see more of you there. Uh, tell us a little bit about this concert that's going to be going on this weekend. Uh, how you got involved with that, and um, what people can expect to see and hear. Yeah, absolutely. So um, I'm working with a production company that's based in LA called High Plateau Productions. Um, they're really a great, a really great production company. Um, they really support independent artists by giving 100% of the funds from ticket sales directly to the artists and the musicians who are doing the live stream concert. Um, so yeah, tickets are five dollars, and all proceeds will go to um, paying me and paying my musicians, which is awesome. It is not something that you find with a lot of concerts. Um, mm-hmm. I'm also partnering mm-hmm. with a local studio to do that. So and then two musicians, Lori Sears is going to be my saxophonist. She's amazing. Has played with all the greats. Um, played on a ton of Broadway shows. And then Tom Kaufman and David Chown are both going to be my pianists. They're incredible musicians as well. Going to be doing a little over an hour um, of singing some some old, older Broadway stuff, Great American Song stuff, and a lot of jazz standards. Um, and, a, and a few James Taylor covers too. So yeah, join me. It's at 7 p.m. Central Time this Saturday. February 6th. It's going to be online. That is, yes, it's going to be February 6th at 7 p.m. People will be able to watch and listen to that. If people want to follow you uh, to hear more of your music, see what's going on in your life, where are the different places, uh, social media or otherwise, that people will be able to find you? 
totally. So there are so many social media accounts. The main ones I would follow are my TikTok at Stella Catherine Cole, um, Catherine with a K, K T H E R I N E. Um, and then my YouTube, which is Stella Catherine Cole as well. I'm also on Instagram at Stella K Cole. Um, and a lot of you from Springfield probably already have me as a Facebook friend. Um, that's at Stella Cole as well. So uh, make sure that you guys go uh, follow her, follow her music. It's on, as I said, Spotify and YouTube. And this Saturday on the 6th at 7 o'clock, you'll be able to watch and listen to the concert, which will be streamed online. There's also a Facebook event. You can be able to find more information about that as well. Stella, thank you so much for joining me, and I'm sure we'll do this again sometime soon. Yes, thanks so much for having me, Kevin. It was great talking to you. It's great talk with you, too. It is Let's Talk Arts and Entertainment on WMAY.